Yeah. Yes, we will on camera, and uh, it actually does need to be adjusted a little bit, but I'll do that between games. Um, was was Putin Dalton playing himself right now? So, I know, I believe Johan was a Sonic in Brawl, and I believe he was considering playing Sonic at one point. It looks like he might be trying to work on it as a secondary. That might not even be new news, but it's new news to me. Um, so I'm not really sure what to expect, because my knowledge of Sonic is that he's generally really slow and campy and lame, but that might not be exactly what we expect. Are you hopping in? What's that? Are you hopping in for commentary? Or are you just moving the bag? I don't think I've seen uh, Johan Sonic before. Yeah, I was just talking about that, because I'm pretty sure it was a Sonic and Brawl. Hmm. And when the game came out, we actually played in, like, a GameStop tournament for the 3DS version. Yeah. And he was using Sonic then, doing, well, not, not wasn't me, but, like, in Grand he used Sonic. Right. So he's got experience with Sonic. Huh. I, just, I was going to say, did he just pick him up last week? Maybe he did. Yeah. Um, I was like, oh, I feel like playing Sonic again. I think, I think Sonic he's talked about, like, a secondary Sonic for a while, because... Yeah. I guess we're all a yeah. fan of the series or something. Hmm. Um, Tell you what I am hoping for is uh, Snake whenever they re-release uh, Smash Bros. for the Switch. Uh, assuming they do. It hasn't yeah, been. Yeah, assuming. Because uh, word has it that Capcom is like supposed to like re-release it or something like that. Yeah. Sakura is working on a new project. Is he? Yeah. He, he didn't say what it was, but he had like... I'd seen on Twitter a bunch. He like casually confirmed that he is working on something so Interesting. a port is likely the question is if they make a port is it going to be just like all the characters put together with all the Wii U and 3DS stages as a collection exactly because they're going like, to they're gonna need to give like incentive to people who are going to actually like you know like yeah. buy the game they can't just be like oh here's the same exact game give us you know $50 <laughs> again they could also do something like well, if you turn in a copy of the Wii U version you get like the game for free or something. About I think I think if they added in like Target has like always in sixty four in melee where you got like an individual one for each character. Yeah. And then you added in like the stages from both games. I think I'd be happy with that. For, I was gonna say maybe maybe like an adventure mode again. And, and I'd be happy with paying full price again. And the whole reason he didn't add like you know the ice climbers and like other characters you know for technical limitations yeah. and hopefully with the new three DS you know. He won't be, uh... Well, not even New 3DS, it's the new iteration, because it wouldn't be on the 3DS, I wouldn't think. Yeah. I think it would just be Switch. Who so knows? Um, I do love the Ice Kind of like how Melee and Brawl was, and, like, the 64 Smash was, like, it was just only for consoles. Yeah. Something like that. I do hope the Ice Climbers come back, though, because even with all the infinites and everything, they're one of my favorite characters. Yeah. I, I just want Snake. Like, that is yeah. literally all I was hoping for. But watch, if they do re-release it and Snake is on there, there's going to be, like, so many Snake mains. I think the only reason, like, I would play Snake is because I love, absolutely love Metal Gear Solid. Huh. I usually don't talk about Chad, but I was going to oh, show you that. Sonic has always been a secondary? Huh. I didn't know that. I'm not surprised. Again, I've heard him talk about it. I I don't think I've ever heard him talk about that. Stone's going to take game one. Ah, looks like I need to pick up Ike. Yeah, Dolan is uh, known for his height. Dang. I mean, darn. Whoops. Yeah. <laughs> that dude, Dolan and Ike, winning game one over Johan. Uh, I was going to say. Still doesn't do anything. Yeah. Just going <laughs> to... You can try to like be comfortable in the match while I'm doing this. Yeah. There we go. Okay. That should work. I think Johan looks good with a beard. Looks a little bit better. Not better, I mean, like, it, it suits him well. Hmm. Beards suit a lot of people better. Yeah. I, I, I'm a lover of beards, which is ironic because I can't grow one. <laughs> Milady. <laughs> Tips Fedora. Huh. Alright. Let's see. So as awkward as it's kind of is to say for someone on commentary, I'm actually not familiar with uh, differences between stages outside of like yeah. the platform layout, so uh, do you also, think there might have been like 
different like reasons he picked this stage outside of just no platforms? Maybe I, I think so. So that way, because uh, if he has platforms with Sonic, he could just uh, do his up B, up air combo. Yeah. Well, it's Sonic the counter pick dealer. Yeah. Uh, uh, who knows? Probably because he can stage spike him a lot better. Because he stage spiked me like almost right away. Ooh, swing gimp. Dude, those gimps are pretty powerful. I remember I was playing on uh, for Salt uh, a few weeks ago, and this uh, Sonic player literally gimped me uh, about six times in a row with his spring. Like, and I just kept on like yep. trying to recover six times in a freaking row. That spring is pretty powerful, or like it's it's a pretty good gimping tool. Oh wow! And I'm with that. You got like a back heavy up smash. Oh yeah, I was gonna say. Some of these hitboxes are so janky. Like um, the fair he did like a few minutes ago. Yeah. Uh, the so uh, Sonic's fair like a few minutes ago. Like it didn't even. Ooh, it, there was no contact, but like still the hitboxes. Oh, that was oh. almost. Almost. That was almost OD. Oh man, things are getting pretty heated. Sure, that was if smart. I didn't, if I didn't know any better, I think he was match <coughs> dancing. Who, Johan? Yeah. Yeah. Because like, he's running back and forth. It was like basically the same thing. Mm. Except it's not like a fluid dash dance. I like the villagers and Sonic's um, uh, stopping sound because it's that screech. Uh, yeah. yeah. Hmm. Oh, right, that so it's bear. Like that, that's a lot faster paced of it, a game than you generally think when you hit Sonic. I was going to say, because, uh, what was it, Johan's <laughs> bears, whenever it comes yeah, to a Sonic, are pretty freaking good. Like, he's pretty good with his bears. It's almost like he's uh, taking some inspiration from uh, his Robin mane, grabbing a book, and reading you. Would you say, would you say nice back air? Yes, nice back air. Yeah. He's going to the game three. Dawn is off to take him to Town and City. Everyone always either goes to Town and City or Smashville. Like yep. Smashville is the new final destination. Because I, would, I wouldn't say new because wasn't Smashville the big stage in Buell too? Uh, no, I think it was more like Final no, Destination. I think, I think it was Smashville. Well, Smashville and <clears throat> Final Destination. I just know like. <laughs> A lot of people like Smashville. Yeah. And then I started in PM, and I didn't like it. Yeah. And so it was a lot better than this game. I just didn't like it with the gravity. Snake handles so much more differently in Project M than he does like in Brawl. I yeah. mean, granted, it's a it's a revamped like engine and everything, but like the first time I played Project M and I tried to do a Dacus, it wasn't as easy. Yeah. It's. I think they made it so it's a two frame window, but every character has it. Yeah. Uh. Sometimes you think you got somebody with an attack, and like the blast zone kind of teases you just a little uh, bit. Yeah. Kind of like uh, at the Arcadian this past Saturday, I was uh, fighting Blue Snack, and uh, I was in the blast zone for longer than I should have been, and then I was like, oh, maybe I'm gonna live, and then boom, game. So that blast zone can be really, really tricky. Especially it was in it was on Battlefield too. Oh, like you moved into it on your own? Yeah, no, like uh, oh, I was in the you. I was in the blast zone. And did he, did he hit yeah. you, or did you just like? Yeah, he hit me, okay. and I was in the blast zone for like about two seconds longer than I expected. And I was like, oh, maybe I'm living. Oh, A yeah, second yeah, yeah. later, game. I yeah. think I think early on there was some weird thing where if you did like a special or an attack while in the blast zone, you just like instantly died. Yeah. But I don't know. if... That's still a thing. But, I, but I, I didn't. I didn't attack though, so that was weird. Like it yeah. weirded me out. I was like, "What?" You know, because you can like, just, like a lot of down a lot of people like, like jump right afterwards as soon as they're sent in the blast zone. It's kind of hard to get out of that mentality of you know jumping right away. Yeah. You know, it's, you should have that mentality of like, "Oh, I gotta save my uh, jump." Uh, not like this. That's not how I wanted to win. <laughs> Dang, he's got those air attacks are going crazy.
Huh. I'm actually really liking Johan Sonic. Yeah. The 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 running around looks really nice. Yeah, exactly. He's not one of those like full glory Sonics. Yeah, it's like the the general Sonics where it's like oh, gosh. campy. Yeah, campy Sonics, which is like kind of ironic because Sonic's fast. Yeah, Sonic's fast. But it's it's because he's fast that he's campy because he's got the best running speed, which means like he can get away from you faster than you can get to him. Yeah. And then punish you for whatever you try to do. Exactly. And he and he, plus he has those jab resets. Yeah. Oh my gosh, those jab resets. But just like just like the running around, uh, yeah. it resembles dash dancing and like melee yeah. movement a lot, which is really appealing to me. Exactly. Makes the game look a lot faster. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, that was terrible. Ugh. I'm getting punished for that. I actually watched a video earlier that was like Ice's movement, and that's just like all I'm thinking about right now, like yeah. watching this. Ooh, is that a nair? That was a nair, right? I don't think that was unfair. Oh, wow. Despite everything, though, Dylan's keeping it really no, close. No, no, that fair. Oh, that yeah, that fair is actually pretty crazy. I just realized something. Uh, you want to type Windows Finals for me? What's that? Uh, this is starting to be a super clutch game. Oh, wow. That back air. That's a good DI. There yep. Holy cow. It says Windows Finals now, which is what it is. Both at like fairly high percent, a good, Holy a good cow. like smashery to look oh. forward to look good. I'm sorry. You gotta, you could use the one that's right in front of the TV screen if you want. Yeah, try that. Sorry, dude. The best three out of five? Yeah. Oh. Finals. Oh, already in the finals? Yeah. Tournament goes by uh, really fast. I was going to say, where is it? There's one of the finals, uh, and we've so, got oh. Alf and Lorenzo. Huh. Who nice. I don't think they're playing. So I, I always get mad when we've got like a bunch of the matches going on yeah. off stream that I want to put on stream. Oh, gosh, yeah. Which like I guess, that I guess one? it's not Especially good. with mods. That's why I was like, oh, yeah. I really want to put my mods up there. I would, I would only want my own mods, but I'm not going to do my own. Yeah. I'm not going to do the modded version of my setup yeah. because I've got the whole control How much do you thing. want to bet? Oh, holy cow. I'm also not a fan of like character aesthetic mods, only uh, like menus and audio or yeah. like music. Mine's, yeah, I was going to say, mine's more cosmetic than anything else, yeah. just like changing skins. I did, I did like the uh, High Will Williams Ganon you had though. Yeah. Um, that game is so good. I wish that game was canon because it was actually really good. Yeah, it, it, it was pretty fun. Uh, because I got the Hyrule Warriors, uh, Link, Ganon, and I used to have the Hyrule Warriors Impa, yeah, you know, over, over Cloud. Hyrule Warriors Impa would have been pretty cool to have in the game. Yeah. Or, uh, Lana. And especially the fact that, you know, Impa had, a, like, a massive sword. It yeah. fits Cloud so yeah, well. Yeah, it does. I think I've seen it before, actually. It was either going to be over Cloud or Ike. Yeah. Oh, have I, you seen the snake mods? No. They look god-awful. They really do. One's over Captain Falcon, one's over Ike, and he has uh, the RPG as the sword. I do not like it. Don't get me wrong. I, I feel like that could have worked. I, appre I appreciate them, you know, trying to implement Snake the game in the game, like in some way, shape, or form, but it does not fit. At least in my personal opinion, anyway. Yeah. It's just nah, not so good. All right, and, so uh, Dalton's still with a little bit of a lead. Yeah. But they're both at percents where they could oh die. Yeah, that commentator's curse once again. It strikes. I'm actually really good at it. <laughs> yeah. It looks like curse word for kids. There's, there was a set a few weeks uh, ago. And, I, mean, uh, I mean, darn. Sorry. There was a set a few weeks ago, and yeah. it was a Game & Watch. And uh, I think it was like, Game & Watch was Falco. And I was like, and you can see the Falco's already <coughs> doing nine. Yeah. Well, I was going to say he's doing better, but... Uh, there was uh, Blue Snake. Was, yeah, it, was Blue, it was Blue Snake and uh, Alf. Let's see. Uh, Alf, we actually got to watch Alf next set. I was going to say. 
because uh, there was a set that was going on earlier off off stream that uh, that was going on straight from the gate. He got a nine. Yeah. And like he was still at zero percentage. Like both were at zero percentage, and boom, nine yep. right away. He's like a really janky game to watch. Yeah. Oh my god, that was really good. That was really good, probably. Holy cow! I like that. Man, Darn's keeping this lead pretty good. Yep. Johan already at like a borderline kill percent, especially with borderline. one of Ike's strong hits and rage. Oh yeah. But watch this movement. Okay. Man, get those tilts. Oh, get the, oh! See those back airs yeah, are pretty. Back air. Yeah, those back airs are pretty freaking good. Really high percent though. So it's gonna be. Oh boy! He sat there and took it. Yeah, I was gonna oh say. I wonder God. what was going on there. Well, Darn wins that set.